Hey, what's up guys? Spencer Rhodes here. So, Angela King was interviewed and she discusses the relationship, bond, dynamic, whatever you want to call it, between Daryl Dixon and Carol Pelletier. I think that's how you say her last name. But Angela King talks about Daryl and Carol and the dynamic that they will have in season 10 and, and some of what we can expect from those two characters. Now, there's a lot, a lot of people that are just crazy about Daryl and Carol having a romance. They just want Daryl and Carol to have a romance so bad, so much. I, I'm not, I'm not going to shit talk them. Um, I don't think there's anything necessarily wrong with that. Me personally, I think that they're just really, really close friends. They deeply, deeply, deeply care about each other. They've been through a lot together. They've always sort of looked out for each other for, for almost a decade now. And I, I think they're, they're kind of like brother and sister. They're, they're more brother and sister than anything else. You know, they're, they're best friends. Even in the season 10 trailer, Daryl calls her his best friend. And, and Carol makes jokes about having you know, matching bracelets. And, and Daryl's being all playful and telling her to just stop talking. And it, it's it's really just... I really see the just the friendship, the, the best buddies thing that they have. Uh, I'm not one of those people that really thinks that they have romantic chemistry. I think that they just have friend chemistry. They're just very close best friends and I think it's a beautiful thing. Just because they're a man and a woman doesn't mean they have to fuck. You know, they can just be friends. I know, crazy, but it's possible. Believe me, it, to it totally is. They're out there. Men and women like that are out there. <laughs> but Angela Kang discusses some of what we can expect from Daryl and Carol's dynamic and this is what she says. Okay, so the child that she... Okay, she's talking about Carol and Henry's death. The child that she adopted and raised into teenagerhood died at the ends of Alpha... At the hands of, Al, of Alpha, and that crushed her. And we'll see what that does to her over the course of the season as she's pursuing revenge against this person. This is one of the strongest relationships in the show. Okay, so she's talking about Daryl and Carol now. This is one of the strongest relationships in the show. They trust each other. They love each other. They are truly best friends. They both came from trauma and from nothing. There's some really deep stuff between them. There's funny stuff, and then there's stuff that gets pretty hairy. They're just kind of on this adventure together. We've been following them for so long, or they're in a scene and you immediately feel the history between those characters. So yeah, I know exactly what she's talking about. They, they've had they've had a strong best friend type of bond since what season two or season three. They they really deeply care about each other, and I look forward to seeing their dynamic, their their best friend dynamic continue into season ten. And as far as romances go, I, I mean, I feel like there's always that chance that Carol and Ezekiel can get back together. I know he kissed Michonne, but Michonne's leaving, and she's leaving soon, so it's not like he's going to stay with her. I don't know if they kill her off, I don't know if they kill him off, I don't know if they kill both off, I don't know if they kill neither off, but Michonne's not going to be on The Walking Dead much longer, so there's really no way that Ezekiel and Michonne are going to stay together. So, the Carol and Ezekiel could still get back together, they really could, and as far as Daryl goes, I think he's going to hit it off with Connie. I, I see chemistry between him and Connie, so <laughs> we'll just have to wait and see if I'm right or not, if I'm right or not, or if I'm just dead wrong about this, but yeah. Anyway, that's all I have for this video. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Don't be shy. Hit that like and subscribe. I'm not going anywhere. I make one to two Walking Dead videos per day, so please hit that subscribe button. Right now we are at 598 subscribers. My goal is to try to get to 600 in the next few days. So just remember, every subscriber counts. Every bit of support matters and is very, very appreciated. Hopefully we can get to that goal of 600. We are very, very close to 600 subscribers. Just two more subscribers and we will be at that 600 subscriber goal. Anyway, with all that said, I am Spencer Rhodes and I will see you guys later. Bye.